The Russian government presented a multi-million dollar helicopter to President Emerson Umningogwa at the 2018 Russia-Africa summit. Umningogwa, who accepted the plane outside of the summit, claimed that Russia and Zimbabwe were both harmed by American foreign policy and should therefore cooperate. The aircraft, whose ownership between Zimbabwe and Umningogwa has not yet been determined, comes just three months after a fleet of ambulances was donated. After giving a quick tour of the helicopter, Umningogwa stated, victims of sanctions must collaborate. Zimbabwe has been subject to sanctions for the past 23 years by the West. We are the same as Russia, which is subject to sanctions from them. Putin and Russia received sanctions as a result of the invasion of Ukraine, which led to a war that has displaced millions of people and has no end in sight. Since Zimbabwe's fight against colonialism, Russia and Zimbabwe have gotten along well. Russia taught cadres from Zimbabwe's two revolutionary parties, Zopu and ZANU-PF, Zipra and Zonla. Its most recent gesture of affection towards Zimbabwe has been viewed as a preliminary step in the international competition for lithium, with which Zimbabwe is rich. Umningogwa has returned to his traditional allies, like Dubai and other new global giants, after his plan for international re-engagement failed to gain traction.